you're a fan of classic comfort food and looking for the ultimate diner experience, look no further. The place to go is Ron's Diner in Minero. Owner Ron Farron explains why he opened such an establishment. Passion. Um, my passion to, uh, just to, to serve people, to uh, make people uh, be happy uh, uh, through their taste buds, uh, with their customer relationships. Yeah, my way I say is just uh, passion, passion in me. Walking into the diner, the ambiance sends you back into time. With classic colors, popular music from the 50s and 60s echoing throughout, and decor that will have you feeling like you stepped into an episode of Happy Days. I got my first uh, restaurant um, job as a dishwasher uh, back in uh, Northern California in the mid-90s. And um, it was kind of like an atmosphere like this. And um, what do you call that? I said, you know, that's where I started from. That's where I'm going to end up you know, uh, going back to it. So uh, um, here I am, you know, and uh, if this section is retro, the other side is, is more local. So uh, I'm, you know, it's from where I started and then where I'm at now. Farron says that Ron's Diner is a play port for your taste buds, acknowledging that the menu is packed with incredible flavor. There's everything here, you know, um, uh, with the menu uh, we have uh, uh, for vegetarians, we have for, for vegans, we have uh, you know, we have hamburgers, um, so uh, yeah, we're, we're um, I'd say the menu is very, um, kind of say, in-your-face type of menu. You know, there's something for everybody, you know, from, I always like to say it's from bankers to ranchers. The menu is truly an interesting one with something for everybody. It will have you coming back to try all the different dishes with an array of lunch specials like garlic fried chicken, oxtail kudu, lemon pepper mahi-mahi, to nostalgic classics with a twist, like the oh my cheese sandwich. For like breakfast, we have um, we have waffles. We make our own waffles. Um, we do our own pancakes from scratch. We also have a chamorro a sausage fried rice omelets. Uh, for lunch, uh, you know, we have uh, burgers, we have fries. We also have um, um, onion steak, uh, we have garlic steak. We have uh, our own fried chicken with our own uh, special twist to the batter. Um, so yeah, there's a variety and our dessert menu is just, you know, we got sundaes, we got um, apple pies. You gotta kinda have a diner without apple pies. We have a blueberry cobbler and uh, we have uh, a lot of things that uh, you might not see in your typical, you know, um, hole in the wall restaurant, you know. So we do come up with a lot of our own unique desserts. So. Uh, very worth uh, stopping on by just to taste too. Ron's Diner chef Vince Moffness is the mastermind behind some of the healthier food fare. We have the vegan lasagna here. Uh, we have a vegetable loaf, a vegetable mushroom loaf. Um, we have uh, uh, his wife's uh, signature <laughs> mango bean patties, you know. Uh, it's going to be rice, and, you know, just still comfort food, you know. The diner, which had its soft opening on Sunday, July 28th, has your typical dishes like sandwiches, burgers, pasta, all with the Ron's Diner touch. And there's even a tasty menu for the kiddos. And what makes the diner unique is an ice cream parlor. We have the ice cream parlor over there with milkshakes, the sundaes like Ron said, strawberry shortcake sundae. We have the banana split sundae, the hot fudge brownie sundae. And then the kids can make their own sundaes, you know, choose whatever they want. Uh, so. Keeps it well-rounded. Situated in the heart of Mingilao, Farron explains how we came about searching for the perfect location. We did go searching around this area. For one thing, I am from Mingilao. So it is, uh, I, can't, I just gotta say, it's close to the house. It's two minutes away, which is a real convenience for uh, as a restaurant owner. Uh, the other thing was, um, Mingilao is booming. You know, Bank of Guam is here, KS is here. You know, there's, uh, I think, uh, we counted like maybe eight different places to eat here, including us would be nine. And then we got, uh, you know, supermarkets here. So yeah, Mingilao is booming. As far as um, as far as the the, the students, um, I uh, we more uh, marketed uh, to the residents. The residents, they're here. We want to make sure that they have some somewhere to go to, to eat. The students will come, but uh, uh, we wanted to cater to the residents here, you know, in Manila, because uh, they never leave. The students, they leave. But you know, we love the students as well. I mean, so if you look at the menu, there's something you know for the residents, and there's something also for the young. You know, um, college student just on the go. You know, so uh, that's how we, um, um, what do you put that, uh, chose this location, and it fit perfect too. The grand opening for Ron's Diner was August. The delight of foodies and Manila residents. Hours of operation are Sunday through Thursday from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. and on Fridays from 6 a.m. to 5 p.m. Now, for more information, you can find Ron's Diner on Facebook, or give them a call at 734-7667. And don't forget to follow on Instagram. We have um, uh, worked really hard 
on putting this restaurant together. We have uh, overcome uh, um, not too many obstacles, but obstacles. Um, uh, for uh, people to come in here, we want to just make, you know, we want to, you know, um, ask them to say, hey, come and try something new. You know, uh, you got new and then you got your typical dishes. And then um, I give a lot of credit to my chefs because um, they, they um, are uh, making everything from scratch, you know, and um, I admire that about them. And um, I just say, come, come down to Ron's Diner and, you know, don't forget, everything's finer at the diner.